Imagine waking up one morning to the sound of sirens. The news is clear, a nuclear strike is on its way. You rush outside, but there is no safe place. The only thought racing through your mind is, what if I had a bunker? Building a personal nuclear bunker isn't science fiction. All across the world, survivalists and even ordinary families have tried to dig underground shelters. Some are nothing more than concrete basements with food supplies. Others, especially those of the rich, look like luxury apartments hidden beneath the earth. At first, the idea seems simple. Dig deep, pour concrete, add steel doors. But reality is different. A bunker must be strong enough to survive shock waves, airtight to block radiation, and supplied with filtered oxygen, clean water, and food that can last years. Without these, your bunker is just an underground trap. Experts say an average person would need tens of thousands of dollars just to build a small shelter. And even then, there's no guarantee of safety. Radiation can seep in through the smallest cracks. Water can flood the tunnels. And perhaps the hardest part is the human mind. Living in a small room for months, maybe years, can break even the strongest spirit. So, would a homemade nuclear bunker actually work? The truth is harsh. Some bunkers might protect you from the first blast, but surviving the weeks and months after is another story. Without constant resources and planning, most personal bunkers would fail. Yet people still build them. Why? Because in the face of disaster, hope is the strongest weapon we have. The question isn't just, can a bunker save you? It's, are you prepared to survive?